Also this noon time, heartbreak for some families as investigators are looking into a deadly collision that happened on 95 southbound very early this morning in Attleboro. I've been news reporter Kate Walsh is working new details on this tragic crash live at the State Police Barracks in Foxborough. That's right, Danielle. We're live outside the Massachusetts State Police Barracks in Foxborough, right nearby the crash on 95 South in Attleboro. State police are just really beginning to investigate what exactly caused that crash. And while they're notifying two families that they lost loved ones in this crash, we're also being told that three people involved in the crash are recovering at nearby hospitals from injuries. Two young people are dead following a crash on Route 95 South just past Exit 3 in Attleboro. Massachusetts State Police say just before 1.30 Thursday morning, a 2018 Kia Soul was speeding in the right travel lane when the driver lost control and swerved, crashing into the back of a Hyundai GST in the middle lane. State Police say there were five people in that Hyundai, including a 23-year-old woman from Los Angeles who was trapped in the back seat and later died at the hospital. Three other people in the car, a 23-year-old man from Illinois, a 23 year old man from Providence and a 27 year old man from California are now getting treated for injuries at local hospitals. We're told the driver of the Kia was the only person in that vehicle and was killed. He's identified as a 28 year old man from Providence. For three hours Thursday morning, 95 South was closed. Traffic was diverted at exit three. Massachusetts State Police are not releasing the names of the victims killed in this crash until family is notified. They're also still trying to figure out why the driver lost control of the car crashing into the other one. But we'll stay on top of this story. We can tell you that on our way here, we noticed on the other side of the highway, the scene has now been completely cleared. Live at Massachusetts State Police Barracks in Foxborough, I'm Kate Walsh, Eyewitness News.